Hi everyone, this is Donna Gilliland with Most Training with a Microsoft Outlook 2010 tip, which is on how to use the conversation feature. You know, if you're like me, you probably get a lot, a lot of email and it can be difficult to keep up with the conversations that we're having on a specific topic. And that's where the show as conversation feature comes in so handy. This feature is located on the view ribbon. So I'm at the view ribbon now. And then within the view ribbon, there's a conversations group. And in the conversations group is the option show as conversations. When you click that option, as I'm doing now, you'll be prompted with a dialog box that asks if you want to show your messages arranged by conversations for all your folders or just the folder that you're activating this for, which in, in my case, I'm in the inbox. Now, before I activate this, let me explain to you what it's going to do for you. Let's say that you and I are going back and forth on a conversation about uh, Project uh, 007, and that's the subject line of the email. Every time that you and I respond back and forth on that specific email with that subject line, then a thread of that conversation will be kept all together and there will be a triangle next to the conversation so that you can expand so that you can see the conversation thread the emails that you and I have gone back and forth on on that particular subject and then you can also collapse the thread every time that an email comes in let's say from you on that specific subject then the email of course will turn bold indicating that I've got another email I need to read within that thread but it's very simple to activate. So as stated, you would go to the View ribbon, choose the Show as Conversations, and when you are met with this prompt, then you can choose to show the conversation arranged in a thread for all folders or just this folder. I'm going to choose this folder. Now right now I have all my emails collapsed because this is my personal email account, so I don't want to show all my personal emails. So you'll have to visualize for a moment. Whenever you turn this feature on, just remember that there will be, as the thread grows, you know, as you, as you receive more emails on the same subject or respond to an email on that same subject, there will be a triangle, much like the one you see here, next to your conversation thread. And when you click, it will expand the thread so that you can see the emails that you um, have sent, uh, received, you know, the dialogue that's going on on that particular subject. Just know that if the subject, if you should change the subject line, you know, if you respond to my email on the subject of Project 007, if you should change the subject line, then that email response will not be in the thread because you changed it. There are other things to know about this feature, but they're very, it's really very simple. And I love it because I can keep up with the conversations that I have on specific subjects a lot easier. I think you'll find it very helpful from a time perspective. So that's it for, for the moment. So try out the Show as Conversations feature and let me know what you think. Well, it's bye for now, and more tips coming your way soon in Microsoft Office, social media, just to mention a few. Have a great week.